Hi. All right. So what is the language of your soul? It's, it's otherwise known as light language. When I was first introduced to the, the language of light, light language, my body vibrated from the words that I heard from this woman. And it, it's like my mind, of course, could not figure out anything that was being said. And but when you get out of your own way and you simply go within and feel what is being said, there's a knowing within you that you've heard this language before, you have experienced it before. And of course, after hearing it the first time, I was really curious and I went searching and I found like, um, Judy Satori and Judy Satori is um, well known for her light language and the activations that she does and I found it very soothing to listen to what she was saying and and even though I didn't know what it was and uh, then what happened was because I'm focusing on being in the quantum field and raising my vibration to a high state, a high frequency, I was told that I would be channeling and I would be speaking light language. And I'll be honest, I just laughed at them. I thought there's no way I'm going to be speaking that. It's, um, you know, after a few days of recovery, I actually started to be curious about it. I thought, really, I'm going to be speaking this language. All right. So then I thought, this is cool. I'm going to listen to my recordings that I had and to listen to all the YouTube channels that I could find it. And I'm going to start like just paying attention. And then one day I got this push. Um, I'm saying a push from the beings of light that to set up my mic i have a, a big microphone that is for doing my podcast to set up my microphone and record myself so i did exactly what i was being told and i took a deep breath and i recorded it and i thought oh my god that just sounds like mumbo jumbo so i i let a few friends listen to it and they felt things in their body and and then i brought it to uh, a friend of mine who's been speaking light language for many years and she had a reaction to it and so that's when it was confirmation for me that it's like i really am doing this and then i found that working with clients what was going on was i was starting to type with my hands so i asked the beings of light what is going on with this and so they explained to me that it's codes and um that i was keeper of the codes and that so anytime i do light language and pass on the codes that is being installed in my client or anyone that I'm doing to. So when you're listening to this, um, when I do light language later and you're listening, you're receiving the codes, which is very cool. Now remember, this isn't about me. This is about our soul. It's, it's, it's the source and, and receiving what our source needs. And so that is the coolest thing. Now, I'm trying to remember what else I was going to say. Um, it's being in the quantum field that raises your vibration and gives you opportunity and, and all kinds of potential possibilities that your life could be on by raising your vibration. I've talked about that a few times, but it's, this is like a game changer for me. I am so excited to be the conduit because that's what it is. Like I said, I'm not, like it's not about me. So I'm allowing it to come through and then you're receiving it. So I am super excited about that. So what I want you to do is not just listen to the words because you're not going to be able to figure it out. 
just close your eyes and take a deep breath. Take a few deep breaths and really relax and let go of, of any kind of stress in your body. That's when you're in a receiving mode. All right, so take a couple deep breaths. I'll do it too. And then when I, like as I speak the soul language, the light language, there's going to be codes installed. Now I've already done one today. I did it in my podcast, so I have no idea what's going to come out right now. Um, but I'm being told it's to assist you in your knowing of who you really are. And uh, so you're ready? <sighs> so deep breath and close your eyes. All right. And um, <sighs> you ready? Akashalana Kamenina, Koshalana Kotula, Sanakana, the Kanmana Lorshun, and then an extra good Manala Kanala Shalana Takala Shalakana. Asanaka Shotomar Kocho, Kosho, Kola Kanala Shanana Kashanala Kosho, Lamanana, Sokola, Takanala Katatununa, Lakana, and Shudola Kanala Kata. Asalana Kosha Lorolo, Kalamen, and Ashanana Kanala Shodola Kata, Asanala Katu Chuchu, Tolakanala Sodola Natasara. Asanala Kanala Kotara. Makaya. <sighs> All right, so let me know in the comments below what you felt when you listened. Now, I don't want you to judge, no judgment. And just basically, how did it make you feel when you heard? All right, and take a deep breath and then go about your day. All right, have a fantastic day.